What's up, YouTube? It's very juicy. I got like four five from my GM token deck. If you want to check out five doors using this deck, be sure to click the annotation on the screen. So I'm gonna go ahead and go over all the cards and I'll tell you why they're in here and all that. So we got three Maxi, three Veilers, three Hidden Armory, three Upstart, two Mallets, three GM Bidding Machines, three Amulet, Am Amulet of Ambition, one Snatch Shield, three Wetlands, three Defense Draws, three Breakthrough Skills. Three token stampedes, three black horn of heavens, three magic green, and one sad warning. So, since you're what this deck does, it gets, it gets out jam tokens. Um, now if you don't know what jam bidding machine does, it brings each of your uh, standby phases, special summon one slam token, 500 attack and defense, but you cannot summon any monsters except slam tokens, but you can set. So, they're really weak, but they can be very powerful if you have token stampede and wetlands. So essentially if you have wetlands, you'll probably be 1700 attack, and then a thousand more for each token stampede you have. So you can get them up to a total of 4700 attack. So that could be, that could be really powerful after, after a while if you have wetlands and token stampede. No, it's like though it's not really be competitive. It's more of a um, more of a fun deck to use. One of three max C's um, for the raw power. So you'll be able to draw jam bidding machine quicker or wetlands and stampede with mainly the three cards you need. So max C will help you draw them. Three effect failures, stop problematic effects. Um, because like Black Rose and Exciton and I, just anything about four really hurts this deck, so you want a effect there in here. Three hidden armories, that's what I like you to add either Amulet, Amulet of Ambition or Snap Steel to your hand, and usually add Snap Steel. Three upstart for the draw power, two mallets because. Like I said, you want wetlands, you want token stampede, and you want jam bidding machines, so if you don't draw them, you can shuffle back, whatever, and hope you get them. Obviously, I already went over jam bidding machine. Um, three Amulet of Ambitions. You can equip these on the jam, jam tokens, and they're level one, so if you equip them on, if you equip this card to them, and you attack like a level, let's say, let's say you attack a level 4, then the token's going to gain um, 5 more attack for the difference in level, so the difference is 3, so they're going to gain 1500 attack if they attack a level 4, and if they have any higher levels, they're going to gain even more than that, so it could be a very nice card. Put this deck. Add one snatch still because it's OP like that. Three wetlands, obviously to boost the attack power of the tokens, defense draw for the draw power, and and to negate battle damage one time. So that could be very nice for this deck. That's why I have three defense draws in here. Three breakthrough breakthrough skills to stop problematic effects, just like effect Vader. Already went over token stampede. Black one to heaven to stop problematic effects again. Like back rows, it's like time I get rid of them immediately as soon as they're summoned. Three magic green because spells are like necros, skid against necros, skid against masked heroes, so it's a very good card nowadays. Five on three magic green. And solid morning. You go solid morning, go through like that. So. This has been my Jam Token deck profile. I want to thank you guys for watching. If you want to check out five doors using this deck, be sure to click the annotation on the screen. And actually managed to beat the new Cyber Dragon deck twice. I beat two different players with they were using Cyber Dragons. So this deck's not so horrible. It's just not really built to be competitive. It's just more of a fun deck. But you can get some wins with it every now and then. So I think you guys for watching. Stay tuned for, or stay tuned for, and actually, just be sure to check out my YouTube videos on the channel, and please subscribe later.